973 to 1050 CE. He was a mathematician, astronomer, physicist, geographer, historian, and anthropologist, truly a polymath. He traveled widely, always carrying his curiosity with him. One of Albiruni's most remarkable achievements was his measurement of the Earth's circumference. Using only geometry, trigonometry, and a mountain near Nandana in modern-day Pakistan, he calculated the Earth's radius with an error margin of less than 1%, and though an extraordinary feat without modern technology. He pointed out inconsistencies in Ptolemy's astronomy and argued for the possibility of the Earth's rotation on its axis centuries before Copernicus in Europe. Uh, his book, Kitab al-Hind, the Book of India, was a pioneering work of ethnography. Instead of mocking or dismissing other civilizations, he described them with respect and objectivity. This method made him one of the earliest figures in comparative religion and anthropology. He explored the refraction of light and the behavior of minerals. His writings on geology suggested that the Indian subcontinent had once been covered by the sea. An idea confirmed centuries later. His methods combining observation, experimentation, and critical thinking make him a pioneer of the scientific method alongside Ibn al-Haytham.